Bovis Homes at Aston Brook, Aston Clinton in Buckinghamshire. And this is the amazing five bedroom Truro show home. The Truro is a remarkable house with those double bays and that lovely white render. Let's take a look around. Hello Emma, welcome Hello. to the Truro by Bovis Homes at Aston Clinton. What's the development name? It's uh, Aston Brook. Yes. It is. Now this is how this house type is one of my favourites. Now being a both beautiful on the outside. Being a bit of a Bovis fan myself, you know, self-confessed Bovis fan, um, I just like the houses I've always done. Yeah, this design actually stems back actually a good few years and this house type was used during the early 2000s. This house type is quite a popular, mm. larger, and it's the second largest Bovis house type, five bed house type that they do. Yes. So, nice entrance hall. I'm expecting big things out of this house. Yes. Okay. Right, let's start in the, in the smallest room, downstairs the, cloakroom. Hey, actually nice wallpaper there, lovely. That's lovely, isn't it? Yeah, but you've got um, the WC push flush there and also a small sink there which is just adequate and a squeezable window in as well. And that's what makes, I think it makes it look so cute is the, is the symmetrical windows that, that mm. are either side of the front door. I see. Beautiful. Right, let's go in the uh, dining room. Very nice quality door and door furnishings. Look. Let me have a look for some dimensions. Look at that. The truth's got a bay. Look at it. Right. This dining room, 4 metres by 2 metres 99. Yeah, nice, Alice. Beautiful, isn't it? Look at the artwork there. Behind you, Steve. Yes. Oh, I don't... Mm. It's unusual. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, so you've got symmetrical bays on this house, haven't we? Yeah. Beautiful. Right. Did you get me a room size on that? Yes, I did it. Okay. Hallway, you could do with a hallway dimension. There isn't one, but there's a room on its own. Isn't lovely it? glass um, banister there. That's really lovely. Look, that is nice. Tree. Right, through into the sitting room. Right, this sitting is big. room, 5 metres 65 by 4 metres 41, which is 18 foot 6 by 14 foot 6. Is that the actual house we're in there? On that little it picture? Is, yeah, they've started doing the little small plans They're as quite well. like them, that's what it should be like. Mm. I'll pick one of these up. Right, so you've got French doors here with the side panels, the little windows there if you just wanted a bit of fresh air. I like those very convenient it's definitely got a kind of safari theme going on in this mm. house so let's see let's see what we can see safari related well look at us over here we've got the the, the two elephants yep what, the mummy elephant and the baby elephant and there's a buddha as well there can't go on with a buddha in your and you've got well maybe it's more kind of travel africa that kind of your fan palm there i mean it's beautifully dressed isn't it yeah luxury really gorgeous yes mm. so this development is currently under construction it's quite a new development it was launched in easter of this year so only a couple of months since Oh, this is different, the kitchen's at the front. Yeah. Oh, it really shows that bay off very really nice, Yeah, it gives you a very different perspective. Yeah. Lovely. But as I say, remember, this is quite an early, the floor plan is quite an early design, yeah. so... And there are going to be 94 new homes on this development in total, ranging in sizes. So you've got an island here, which is a lovely feature. What's this? Oh, that's your fridge and freezer then. The 
a cupboard there with your RCD box, your alarm and things. Lots and lots of beautiful work surface. Integrated appliances. Got the big drawers here under the gas hob, which has got five burners. Can we show the viewers this? This is the, uh, the light bulb drawer. So this is an indication of how many different light fittings there are in this house. Do you they know, just employ someone full time? Yeah, to that, that's the bulbs? a full time job managing those right. light bulbs. You can always, isn't it? You can't Imagine have... having to order them and you know choose the sizes. That just blows your mind, doesn't it? Yeah. But look at them now. Well worth it. Yeah. And if you want your home well lit, then you need a drawer like that full of light yeah. bulbs, don't you? What's this? Right. Oh, we're going to pull out the larder. And don't forget, with Bovis, a lot of what you see is what you get. That's true, you know? yes. Got a breakfast bar on this side of the island, which is lovely. Lots of banks of sockets there and switches. This is kind of nice, how this bit is raised. And yeah. You can just lean on it a little bit. But on the other side of it, cupboards. Ah. Look at that. The kind of yeah. large shelves that are yeah. boxed in, but how useful is that? And somewhere else to sit and eat. So yeah. you've got your separate dining room for lovely, nice occasions, but you've also got a breakfast area. You could have a sofa here, yeah. you could have a TV. This could be your family area. Well, over there is the socket the for the satellite or whatever if you yeah. require. Well, you could have it both. You could have a little breakfast yeah. table and a sofa. Got a separate utility room. So if I just open some doors here. So room for your appliances, cupboards. There's another space at that end. There is actually a door behind a door, Steve, if you can get round there. I reckon that would be that. Uh, yeah, that's just it's a good cupboard. old store cupboard with the boiler in as ah. well. Good size, that's all right, isn't it? So behind me here, we've got the door to the rear garden as well. Lovely and light and bright isn't it in here? Yeah. Of course we didn't mention you've got French doors there with separate windows as well, your small windows at the top for a bit of fresh air. So French doors in here, French doors in the sitting room as well. I really like this kitchen. Down up on the sweep around. Lovely staircase, that really nice. Right, we'll go and take a look up to the first floor. Okay, first floor then. Right, I think if we start around there, we've got bedroom three. So, at the front of the house, above the bay in the kitchen, this bedroom. Bedroom three. Just over the four metres by three metres six. Thankfully it stopped raining now, because yeah. it was chucking it down the area. You said it was on all day. Good well, job I didn't use you. I the checked weather, the woman. weather and it was. But this is such a lovely village, isn't it? It's actually a small town. Is it a village? Small town. It's gr a growing... God, yes. it is. Yes. There's a lot of development going on here at the moment. Yeah. Um, in terms of schools, we've got a primary school just down the road. Um, you've got a couple of really good grammar schools and, a, and a, an ordinary senior school not too far away. Aylesbury's the nearest big town. It is, and that's where most people tend to migrate for their shopping yeah. and you know other things that you might want. Yeah, it's very close by. Very, very well connected for London, Milton Keynes, etc. Yeah. So you've got yeah, the M1, uh, the, the M1, the M5, it's the, it's the corridor between. This is bedroom four that you're in. Three metres 88 by just over the three metres. Yeah, we've got the bamboo thing going on in here as well, haven't we? Yeah. With the globe. And the lion. Yeah. 
is your main bathroom on the first floor. So how, how would you describe this bathroom? Give me some... Because I always do Stylish. It. Yeah. Very stylish. I like the square bath as opposed to a more rounded off bath. I think it's very, very nice. Yeah. I also like the central controls, the central tap, etc. With, you, yeah. with your hair washing attachment. How do these work then? How does... Well, yeah, well, you, you push it in, don't you, I think. There you go. Oh yeah, but I'm what not about? I'm going to switch it on because I've already got wet in the rain about, today. But what about for the 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 plug? You press oh. it in. Is that the plug? Oh, I like that. Mm. Right. So this is for washing your hair when you're in the bath. Okay. Very, very, very useful. Yeah. It's a nice. It's a nice. It nice, is a useful nice. thing to have, most definitely. So. Beautiful suspended sink. Again, you've got the squared sanitary ware, which I think is really lovely. Yeah. Uh, toilet with a push, push flush. Are we ideal standard? We are, yes. Very good. The shelf is very useful. It's got its own window. And then you've got this gorgeous big shower as well, look. Yeah. So everything you could possibly want. As well, it looks like someone's already stood in there today, doesn't it? Yeah, it looks like someone's had a shower. Someone's took a shower. Yeah. Okay, so at the rear, we have got bedroom two. So here, you're at the back of the house and above the sitting room. So the window will look over the back garden. And you can see what an interesting garden they've got in this show home. Yeah. But also, you can see the development that's going on. Yeah. There's a wide range of houses on this development, isn't yeah, there? Yeah, there You've are got all sizes, threes, yes. Um, threes and fours and fives. And obviously this one, which is a five, yeah. yeah. Well, you've got, a, you've got a lot of different house types that for all, cater for all... All, all budgets. Yeah. Yeah. This bedroom's got an ensuite. Similar sanitary wear to the uh, yeah. bathroom. It is almost an identical bar the bath, really. Yeah. You've got plenty of room for additional furniture in here. You've got this alcove here, yeah. which would be really good for a wardrobe. Am I guessing, do you reckon we've got a dressing room probably here? Ah, well, we're not See, we going, haven't, we're this not is what... We're not going to go in there for a minute. But we we don't, we here. don't actually look no, around and look. No, this is the look. first time we've been in it. Right, so this is bedroom five. So this is your smallest bedroom, essentially, but actually a really good size. Uh, just over the three metres by three metres, so it's almost a square. Yeah. But you could fit a double bed in here, couldn't you? Yeah. Easily. They dressed it as a child's room, but it could be a double bedroom. The windowsill's nice. If you look at it, it's actually kind of hip height. So it allows lots and lots of light in. You can see we're actually at the top of the, this is the entrance. Yeah, that's the porch, the isn't it? The entrance porch, really nice. Yeah. And obviously this house is right on the front of the yeah. development, isn't it? We're driving, like I say, it's a really nicey villagey theme. Isn't it? Oh, look, did you see the picture? What picture? <laughs> look at the rabbit. Mm. Yeah, but you need to be able to see see his funny legs, look, with his feet. Right, come on. Last but not least, then, master bedroom. Okay. So, bedroom one, dimensions 3 metres 68 by 3 metres 64. See this here? This, this. Yeah. This has only kind of been recently been done, hasn't it? Kind of people doing that. It's not been like around forever, has it? Well, you can do it with someone else or you can do it on your own. Never just imagine, though. It's such a simple thing, but actually quite a new thing. Yeah. Right, let me give you the measurements again. 3 metres 68 by 3 metres 64, which is actually 12 foot 1 by 11 foot 11. Oh, I so was expecting a dressing really room. but good size. It's all right though. You, you need a dressing room when you've got that big wardrobe. You could fit a slightly bigger bed in yeah. there if you want. What, you think there should be a dressing room? Yeah, I well, think for the size of the house. I think, look at this. So you've got ample storage here. Yeah. Fitted wardrobes. 
Although actually in our house, I've got this much just for me, haven't I? And, and don't forget, more. as we've said previously, all this is included. Yeah. Yeah, the wardrobes, etc. you know. Right, so this beautiful house has got an en suite. Take a look in there. Again, I don't want to repeat myself, but this is pretty much the same as the previous en suites. Um, you know, the tower and etc. But, uh, you know, it is an adequate size. Squeezed a mirror in as well. So, you have two bedrooms with en suites and a master bedroom. It's a generous house. Out of the five, most definitely. It's a generous it's very, house. Very, isn't very, very nice, yes. Well. So, I will pop up. All of the details about this house in the description box down below, along with a lot more detail about the local area, the amenities, everything you need to know essentially, and also uh, a link back to Bovis' own website so that you can contact them directly for current pricing and availability on this site. But do come and have a look yourself because it's worth a look, isn't it? It is. And I'm just looking over there, you can see how diverse this village is, look. You've got loads of houses up there. Yeah, yeah, it's almost like a high street and then you've yeah. got a Tudor house. Yeah. Right in the middle there, look. I don't know whether that's... You it know. almost looks like something out of a, a ski lodge yeah, village, doesn't it? Is, it? Or isn't something it? that has But it there. is such a lovely, Unusual. lovely, lovely place. And some beautiful hills there in the background. Yeah. You well, I am filming the... them now. I'm oh, just well, nearly... you can see the black clouds over there because yeah. it has been torrential has. today. But check out Bovis playlist um, yes. on our YouTube channel, which you're already on, and uh, click and like it. Give us a like and a subscribe. We'd be much appreciated. Yeah. Thank you for watching. We will catch you on our next video. Bye for now.